First play I'm looking at tonight is coming from the points section. And we're looking at Tyler Hero. They're playing the Lakers. The game is in LA. His prop on the night on prize picks is 21 and a half. Projection from props.cash is 24.76 with a differential of 3.26. As you can see, the books got him a pretty heavy, heavy favorite to go under. Playing a bad Lakers defense. He's went over 21 and a half points in 57% of the time during the season. During his last 10 games, five games, 60% of the time against the Lakers, 50% of the time this season. Let's look, take a closer look at Hero. Points allowed, as I pointed out earlier, Lakers is one of the worst in the league, 27. Uh, at 27, they're 30th against the shooting guard defense. This game is in LA. Let's look at the uh, away games for the last. Let's look at he was away games for the last 10. As you can see, he's hit that mark 80% of the time. Uh, I like the so called superstars on the road for points. Uh, you can say he rose a superstar for uh, Miami, him and Butler. So I tend, I, they tend to be a more aggressive on the road looking for their points. I like Tyler Hero to go over the prop of 21 and a half uh, points tonight against the Lakers. Second pick I'm looking at tonight is coming from the rebound section. And we're looking at LaMelo Ball. His prop is six and a half. The projection from props.cash is 7.64. It's a pretty heavy pretty heavy favorite on the books. Minus 135 to go over. Emphasis is pretty middle of the road against uh, rebounds. Uh, Melo is on a streak of seven straight games where he's, where he's went over six and a half rebounds. Let's look at him a little bit closer here. As you can see in his last 10, he's went over 70% of the time. Offensive rebounds allowed. He has the advantage against Memphis. Rebounds allowed, that's mean total, defensive and offensive. Uh, Memphis is pretty middle of the road, 18, 18 uh, in the league. Defensive rebounds are a little bit better, they're eighth in the league. So, Melo's been hot. Uh, this, this is a home game in Charlotte. I like Melo to go over the prop of six and a half rebounds at home. I'm actually a little shocked this line hasn't went up on prize picks to around seven, which it probably will do later on in the day once the betters get a hold to it. Uh, but I think it's uh, he will go over the prop of six and a half rebounds. Third prop we're looking at, we're looking at the assist. And we're looking at DeMar DeRozan for Chicago. They're playing Brooklyn. The game is in Chicago tonight. Four and a half is a prop. His projection on props.cash is 6.8. Pretty heavy favorite to go under. Let's look at DeMar a little bit closer. He's went over four and a half rebounds in 70% of his games in the last 10. For the uh, last 30, 57% of the time. Let's look at home. In home, only 44% of the time in this last 30. Last 10, 40% of the time. Last five, 60% of the time. Chicago played, a, you know, they gave up a lot of points to one player in the last game, Donovan Mitchell. Uh, as you can see, assist allowed. Brooklyn is decent. Actually, they're very good. Number four in the league. But I like DeMar Rosen to go over the prop of four and a half assist for tonight in home. Next prop we're going to look at is going to be the three-pointers made. And we're looking at Buddy Hield, who is on fire. Uh, his prop is three and a half three pointers. Projection by props.cash is 4.37. Pretty heavy favorite under the books to go under 3.5 um, three pointers tonight. They're playing Philly. Team is very good defensively. Buddy Hill is on a streak of six games of making more than three and a half three pointers. So something has to give tonight. Let's look at Buddy Hill a little bit closer. Over his last 10 games, he's 80%. Over his last five games, he's 
This is what I'm looking at over here. Philly defense, three points allowed, they're third in the league. One of the best. Three point percentage allowed, they're first in the league. Against shooting guard defense, they're sixth in the league. In his last game against Philly, he hit three three pointers. I think Buddy Hill will hit three three pointers again tonight. I just do not think he will hit four. And we're going to take the under on Buddy Hill for three pointers made tonight. The last prop I'm looking at for tonight, we're going to be looking at the points, rebounds, and assists. And we're looking at Tyrese Halliburton. Line is 31 and a half. Projection by prop site cash is 38.11. Over six points over his, uh, his line. Pretty heavy favorite to go under 31 and a half. Uh, here. So let's look at Tyrese a little closer here. He's went over this mark 60% of the time in his last 10 games. Last five, 60% also. Against Philadelphia in his one game this year, he went over, he had 35 points in it, 35 points, rebounds, and assists in his last game against uh, Philadelphia. And that game was in Philly. The game tonight, let's see where it's at. The game tonight is in Philly also. Again, I like stars to be aggressive on the road. Usually looking for their points, so his points is probably in play for me also tonight. Uh, but we're gonna go with his points, rebounds, and assists. Even over here, we see Philly's very good. Points allowed, number two. Rebounds allowed, middle of the road. Assists allowed, six. Point guard defense, they're seven. They're good in all defensive categories. They slow the, down, slow the game down a little bit. But Halliburton is playing at an all-star level. I don't see anything different tonight that would change um, he had only he had 30 in his last game against uh, Toronto and home let's look at him away also are they at home I'm sorry no, where is it no they're on the road let's look at him away away he's hit this mark 50 percent of the time this year in his last 10. Let's look at the season. For the season away, he's hit it 63% of the time. With implied odds, minus 167 to hit this. Going my gut on this one, I like Halliburton to go over the prop of 31 and a half points, rebounds, and assists. So those are a few picks I like. Go ahead and like, subscribe, let me know who you're going with. Drop something down in the comments. Let me know who you're going with. Uh, but these are a few of picks that I like for today. Uh, always using props.cast to help us quickly and accurately determine which way we're going to go on these props. Uh, link down in the description to props.cash. And also, you just put in my code. Just go to props.cash and put in my code. Wise got bets. That's all I have for today. Until the next video, peace.